where Donaldsonville, we got the largest ammonia producing plant in the United States. It took away from tourism. It's hard for to enjoy tourism on the outside, like a plantation or any other or facility. And you uh, on the outside trying to look at oak trees and stuff, and then you got plants having all kind of smells, and you got to explain to them, you're always just a uh, nitrogen smell, or oh, it's just a mercury emission or whatever. It's, it's hard to enjoy those things, and that's horrible. Just with that one plant alone, I had you know getting sick this year. I had problems with my lungs because it the ammonia had weakened my immune system. I jog uh, jog on the levee all the time, and then knew that ammonia traveled so far. I stay on the out, I stay on way on the other side of Donaldsonville, the plant on one side, and it still had travel all the way to the other side of Donaldsonville. So when it weakened my immune system, it made me have allergies to things I never had allergies before. Let me tell you about Louisiana. We different. You know, a lot of people is peaceful. I'm peaceful, but I'm not, Louisiana not like that as a whole. They'll, they'll get unpeaceful. <laughs> and that's a word I can use. Me in Southeast Louisiana and a lot of people around the United States, we not really cutting no slack. We got information, we got databases, we got movies coming out. We gonna be on y'all. Tell y'all gonna be in the churches, we gonna be in the churches too. Y'all in schools, we in schools too. Y'all gonna be up there in community meetings, we in the community meeting too. Y'all in stores, we shopping in stores, talking to people and everything. We even, y'all talk about going through the all, putting pipelines in the buyer. Guess what, we on the buyer, in the canoes, been letting people know, hey, we don't want Bayou Bridge Pipeline damaging in our buyer, we fishing.